Welcome, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is Cosmot Gaming with me, Christopher, and we're back with EU Europa Universalis 4 and our playthrough with Byzantium, where we are going for the Basileus achievement, which means restoring the Roman Empire. Last time, with a bit of clever tactics, we were able to get a hold of two terrorists. Two terries, two territories on the Anatolia part of the Ottoman Empire, or what's left of the Ottoman Empire, as well as locking the Mamluks into a uh, truce with the Ottomans, because we don't want the Mamluks to take this territory. We don't want to lose more territory territory of this place to the Mamluks because we are gonna have to fight the Mamluks at some point and we don't want them to be stronger than necessary let's just say and Kandar by the way yeah you are allied to the Mamluks that's one of the issues here there are a couple of things that uh, might go wrong in the future we we will see about that but um, that is a good thing that is a good thing we have a truce that is actually coming up in just uh, about three years uh, in, uh, after which we will go again for uh, the Ottomans. They are allied to Crimea and Fars. Where's Fars? Isn't that down here somewhere? No. Oh, right. It's over here. You you look tasty, but uh, only 5,000 troops for some reason. You've been a, in a war. That is true, but still. Um, and then Crimea, as we've already been talking about, I was about to say, no, we did talk about it, but uh, what I did was that I attacked Crimea and then took territory from the Ottomans, because we were in a truce with the Ottomans, which meant that uh, going for the Ottomans obviously wouldn't be an option, because the Mamluks wouldn't be joining. Where actually would they? I don't. I don't know what the what the deal was, but basically, because we attacked Crimea, Mamluks joined us and. Life was good, which means that we now have um, a foothold on the Anatolia part of the world, which means that it's going to be slightly easier to go for the Ottomans. Uh, question is, how do I handle the next uh, war? Well, I don't think it's going to be that much of a problem, because the Mamluks seem to be uh, fairly uh, fairly okay with being down here, which means that when we actually attack them, we should be able to get to the territory immediately. And if they uh, siege down this, they shouldn't be getting enough war score to piece out the Ottomans separately, which is what they've done, the bastards. Uh, by the way, do I have... No, I still don't have any claims here. And the worst thing about this is... Uh, I need this territory for this, uh, this mission to be over. And... Uh, if I do that, I also get this. Uh, is, aren't these the same? Right, I've done this. Never mind. I've, I've done that, which gave me the course. Uh, that leads to down there. Okay, so that's fine. Um, what do I need for this? Have I not done this? No, I haven't done this. Uh, no, okay, so... Are these just the same? Oh, oh, but that has the orthodox uh, thing as well, which this doesn't. Okay, fair enough. But yes, they, okay. So I do need, uh, I do need this territory, and Aragon has taken this territory at some point. They t took over the knights, you know, previous war, and then they took this. Now they are in a war. It's a big war going on here. Uh, but sadly, Aragon is not losing that war. They are actually. Presumably winning this war. Uh, the war is Burgundy against France, and France is attacking Burgundy. And that's a pretty decent war score already, which means that presumably Aragon is not going to lose this. I was sort of hoping that uh, uh, that uh, 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 Burgundy would piece them out and hand this back to Ottomans. Uh, because if they don't, we have to go for Aragon. They are allied to France <laughs> and Venice. So Aragon is not an easy opponent. We have a... This does not happen that often, I think. <laughs> but it happened on this occasion. So good, 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 good. Uh, yeah, because I would be getting France, Papal State, Tuscany. But I would be getting a lot of difficult opponents against me if I go for Aragon. So exactly how I'm going to deal with this. I mean... Even Tuscany, you have 30,000. It's amazing. Um, the Papal State, also, I, they have really powerful allies, all of them. All of them are powerful allies, so... Uh, 
I mean, the, I guess that the only the, the only thing that I can reasonably do, I guess, is go for this. Uh, is that what is that? Finding another war? Right? Oh, oh, fine, fine. What are you doing? You are fighting Denmark, right? Poland is going for uh, this territory for some reason. I don't know why, but sure they are. Uh, let's uh, start time taking along. We are. Chilling out a little bit here, because we have some rebels that might come in. I... Oh, my Admiral has sadly died. That's sad, because it was good. Um, we are not truce with Serbia. We could go for them at some point. Silly, do I not have... Yes, I do have uh, CBs against you, but... Uh, are you... You are protected, okay. And automatically you would be co-belligerent. That's... That's not fair. <laughs> uh, we could go for Hungary, though, I think. Yes, uh, we could go for Hungary, but again, yeah, we have a truce with them as well. So we, we have a truce with most of the people that we can, or nations, maybe I should say, most of the nations that I can't attack. So that's not going to be a thing. Jenna we have here, but Austria again. Aust Are you protecting, like, several people, several nations? Wait, wait, wait I, I need to understand this. This is a new thing after a recent patch. Um... Yana is part of the M. Oh, right, you're part of the Empire. Never mind. Are you? Are you part of the Empire? I did not think that you would be, but okay. Fair enough. N now I know why Austria would be there. Uh, Ottoman, so you're doing everything. You're uh, getting a few troops back there. By the way, how's this looking? I could actually drill a little bit here. I really don't want to lose stability. I really don't want to lose stability. We're at zero. Uh, but I do. <laughs> Man, I'm getting a lot of corruption. Okay, fine, whatever. Okay, so they are coming up to 80. Oh, okay, so because I did that, they feel like they're a little bit more powerful. Yep. Or did something happen? Did I do something for that to happen? Oops. I hope I didn't screw myself up here unnecessarily. We are strengthening up our nation, by the way. Uh, what can we go for? We can go for Diplomatic, but I would like to tech up first. So we are not going to do that. Nope. So I would like for these to fire, if possible. Scotland and Croatia, sure. Uh, yeah, we're building some stuff. We can actually keep building, but I don't know if there's anything... I mean, 12 isn't really... That's not really good enough in my mind. Uh, dress to for some trade might not might be a good idea. Might be a good idea. What I would like to do, however, is the shipyards to get more ships. So I might actually start doing that. Uh, what do we have here, for example? Good place to build a shipyard. That is in Burgas. And, uh, but yeah, really, we're just waiting for the war against the Ottomans, the inevitable war. We need to be the one starting that. Uh, the Mamluks cannot be allowed to start it. And um, maybe I should actually turn this on. <laughs> maybe I should turn that on. Because there we go. Respond. Uh, I don't really have to attack them. We can just chill here and see where they go, because this is not going to be... Uh, incurring us with some uh, separatism because of the fort. There we go. Because of the fort. Cool, cool, cool. And uh, that just means that you can move uh, preferably into Smedrevo. And we can attack you there. If you would. This should be a territory where they uh, would be interested in going into. Yep, yeah, there we go. Go here, attack them. In a defensive battle, not a problem whatsoever. We have a better general, etc., etc. There we go. Get in there, take the territory back. We don't actually even need to do that. But it's fine. So yeah, there has been a patch between uh, the previous episode and this episode. And as always, that's a bit scary. Because the game even says that uh, <laughs> it could be issues to a point where Iron Man saves get ruined. <laughs> that would be would have been bad. It would have been really, really bad. Uh, we can do one more ship. I don't have any light ships right now, but I feel that controlling the seas here is actually what I want most. 
And now that I think about it, why did I do that? We are building a shipyard. It's going to be faster, faster to build a ship in here. So just wait until this is done. By the way, how much is it to upgrade this? Uh, da, 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 270. Right. Let's not, uh, let's not worry about that right now. Let's worry about just building a regular ship. There we go. War galley. It's going to be a lot faster now, which is cool. So are you doing anything? Not really. You're also not doing anything. No new alliances, which is exactly what I want to see. Should have no problem with you. We're at the same tech level as well. Military tech, so that's good. Uh, what's going on here? Are you in peace? You are in peace. You did not take that. Uh, I missed the peace deal here. Uh, full organization. Finland is no more. They were a bit, you know, uh, for a while, but they are no more. Uh, yeah, I missed that peace deal. Would have seen what happened, but presumably, did you take anything? I don't think you did. Oh, well, this is this is all Denmark still. Nothing at all. Okay, whatever. Uh, Lubeck has Bornholm. Okay, <laughs> there's a lot of weird stuff going on up there, but we don't care. We're we're, we're doing stuff down here. Let's uh, mothball the fort. How's our economy looking? 4.5. I would like to reduce my inflation, but we are not going to. Because we have a cheaper plus two national tax modifier guy, and that is way more, way better for my economy than uh, something else. We are doing this. Maybe I should rack or whack this up a bit. We can probably do like point. Two. Yes, let's go up to point two. See if we can uh, get down that corruption. And uh, we have a free thinker as a basileus. Nice, idea cost down. That's, uh, I mean, that's useful. But we are looking for uh, Diplo Tech here. Uh, getting it more combat width, which is actually not all too bad. But our, what is our combat width for ships? Uh, can I see that engagement with base 5 so 35 we're not even close to that so okay that technology upgrade wasn't super important but yeah we we're gonna get that immediately um i have three diplomats let's whack some of you in here because i do want to annex you as soon as possible i don't feel that this is helping me too much right now you know so we're gonna get rid of you. Goslar. What? What is a Goslar? Goslar is apparently one of more free city that I have not heard of. And I'm losing my... I have been losing my great power status for quite some time now. Yep. Uh, we are gonna regain power. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. More inflation. <laughs> just, uh, just get that inflation up. That is absolutely cool. Uh... Yeah, we have some claims over here, amongst amongst others. Who wants who wants to walk through my territory? Sure, Württemberg. Silly. Well, that's Würzburg. That's a flag that I don't recognize. Würzburg had a different flag before. Oh well. So troops is coming up. Troops is coming up. March fifteen sixty one. And we can actually do one more ship. Why did I not do more ships? There we go. You can do all of the ships, as a matter of fact. Uh, yeah, get over here. Join up with this fleet. No fleet. There we go. Um, I think it's time to put my force over here. Actually, let's do that fort as well. And this fort. All the forts. Let's get the forts up. Uh, do you have mothballed forts? You uh, have not mothballed your forts. That's a bit of a shame. But it's fine. And uh, we will not be asking them for uh, military access, obviously. Uh, maintain the diplomat there. 71. We have been a little bit, you know, bad <laughs> here. We treated them a little bit badly, so that's why they are a little bit annoyed at me. Right. S 
There we go, pause the game, we are going to war immediately. So, let's go for Saruhan, I guess. Get uh, both Mavlus and Poland in. You are still fighting in another war. What, what war are you fighting now? Now you're fighting against Riga, so you're just, you just want to take Riga. Oh well. Fine. Um, yeah, let's go for Saruhan over here. Sadly, Aragon was able to keep that. I want to check that war as well. Uh, Crimea Forest, that's okay. Hopefully Poland will help us here. They are in this war, obviously, but it's not their war, so that's why they are okay with joining us. Uh, so yeah, let's go for this. Let's go for this. How many troops do you have? About 8,000. Cool, cool. Let's go in on their uh, capital here. Let's try and siege this down as fast as possible. I would actually like to get a admiral here. Got a fair admiral. Not not anything super cool, but uh, not too bad either. If you would come up and help me a bit, I know that I said that I was going to go down and siege down stuff here, but I'm not at this point. Why are you not coming up and hooking up here? Because here's the thing: they have two heavies. Uh, Three lights, seven galleys. I have 21 galleys. I should be able to do that. It is an inland sea. I have extra fighting capacity for my galleys, and I have a lot more galleys. I think that should be fine. Let's see. We'll see about this war. How's that looking? That is looking... Nope, that is not looking good. I thought that I would be able to do this. I guess the heavy ships... Oh, no, 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 it's fine. Right, uh, let's get down to the next one. We actually did. Did I capture ships? Uh, I captured... I, I lost uh, I lost two galleys, but I captured two uh, transports. Transports aren't really what I wanted, but sure. Uh, that means just... Oh, okay. No, no. Uh, fine. We'll, we'll, we'll be out a few of those. That's fine. Uh, Mamluks are coming in. Mammoths are coming in, but the, the, the Ottomans are actually going over there, so I'm, I'm okay with that. It means that Athens can come in and help me out a bit here. At least they did a little bit. We don't need uh, everyone here now anymore. So that's you. You don't need you. So you can just... Okay, fine. Whatever. <laughs> uh, I would like to siege down a few things here. Uh, yeah, no... Uh, yeah, that, that's fine. Felt like I lost something here, but I don't think I did. So let's go up and capture this little, this little horsey horsey over here. Go down here. We get a half of uh, statesmen, you say, but that's probably going to be more expensive than what I can deal with. So let's not bother with that. Uh, Clergy can get even more. Man, they're influence, influential and loyal. We can lose a whole bunch of patriarch authority for gold. Or ducats. But no, we don't really need the ducats right now. So I'm just going to leave that be. My question is, are you going to... Good job. You're actually sitting down this for me. I did not think that you would do that. To be quite fair. But I'm happy you did. Uh, are you... Yes, you're dealing with Crimea. We're gonna be dealing with Crimea soon as well, I believe. There we go. All of the Ottoman territory here taken care of. So the Ottomans are all but taken over. So we shall gather our troops. Can I count on you, Poland? I don't know if I can, so we are gonna... We are going to do this, and I think that... Nope, we don't have any one connected with us. Who's here? Ansbach is just here, chilling out. Okay, let's go up here. We're going to fight Crimea a bit. Yeah, no, you actually broke that. Oh, the Ottomans are up here. And that's a bad, bad decision, so to speak. Yeah, okay, so the Ottomans, etc., etc., are going up here, you say. Well, we are capturing the Crimeas here, I think. The Ottomans are going to try and help. They will just be able to, but also not. So we are going to hopefully destroy the Ottomans. 
Uh, we can get a natural scientist, also skill 3. So, no, indeed, we will just ask you to work harder. More admin power for me. That is a nice battle against the Ottomans. So let's go and siege down this place. Because I don't think that they have anyone here now. So yeah, the, the, see, the Mamluks took a bit for themselves. Uh, but you only have plus one, so that is not going to help you. So this is going to go well for me. But Aragon. Damn you, Aragon, for taking this little territory here and having really, really powerful allies. Uh, you, go up here and fight. Uh, together with you. We should have no problem here. Nope. That was very easy, which means that we can go up here, I guess. Yep, there we go. And you have a lot of ships, though. I am not confident about that, sadly. <laughs> okay, uh, retreat, go repair. We sadly cannot help with the siege here. The Ottomans are returning a little bit. We're losing diplomatic power, that's fine. I'm fighting a bit over here, but that's not me, so I'm okay with that. Mamluks are fighting a bit. They're all losing, though, which isn't exactly what you would like to see. Uh, by the way, totally forgot about, about the war taxes. Get the war taxes. Absolutely. Absolutely get the war taxes, because that means that we are somehow losing. Oh, that... Ah, it's on or off. Never mind. <laughs> Oops. Uh, we can't take up military. We don't need to take up military right now. We can, however, piece you out for quite a lot of money, I think. Still trade, war operations, whole whack of money. Uh, you can be allied to people. Yes, that's okay. Um, I don't have a problem with you. Being allied just means that I can get more money. So let's get back. You are forced out. Get up, fight you some more. There we go. I wouldn't mind capturing one of your big ships, by the way. I have! I have captured a big ship. Wasn't that just lovely? Right, let's get down here. And it's time to. Oh, for Forest. Forest is, forest is ready to be pieced out as well. Are you not? What? What are you? Oh, right, because you have a lot of a lot, a lot of territory. And the Ottomans are here. It feels like the Ottomans have a few more troops than I thought that they would be having. I guess that they have uh, probably, presumably, gone into depth a bit to fight this war. And I know what I want to do, by the way. Uh, I might actually want to do that. Where am I? I am at 10. Which sort, sort of means that I want to do this. So let's actually do that. Uh, manpower and discipline, thank you. And then we can just lose the five Patriarch Authority that we don't even have. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, so we're trying to get to you before you manage to siege that down. I think. I, I thought I was. Uh, we have Ottoman Separatists, you say, in these places. I th oh, and you actually took that. Well, of course you did. Um, well... Can we just white piece you? Yes, we can. I'll just white piece you. I, I, I'm okay with that. So, uh, that means that we can probably take everything that we want. Like, without any problems whatsoever. And if we take this back, absolutely, 100%. Of course you want peace. Uh, I want... That. Can I ser seriously not take more than this? Man, that's bad. And all of those nations I don't care about. You can go for me if you want to. Should I just leave that one then? Uh, let's go back to our stuff here. What do I need? Uh, go over here. So it is actually not that territory. Well, okay. You know what? Then I will take that. No, I won't. Because, again, uh, level 1 fort. You can have that. You can have your level 1 fort. I'm okay with that. Uh, I will have you revoke a whole bunch of cores, though. As many cores as I can. Uh, wait, what? How, how do you... Right, you have cores here. Uh, of course you do. Uh, you're gonna revoke cores. 
Uh, we'll start with uh, down here, I guess. Uh, oh, oh no. Where do you have. Uh, let's. Uh, let, okay. Never mind. Let's do it like this. Can I do. No, I cannot do that. Okay, whatever. We, we need to just read here. <laughs> so. Thessaly, yes. Uh, Epirus, you probably won't have a core on. Uh, yes, you did. Okay. Uh, Castoria. Valora. Yes. So that's a good start, I think. However, maybe I want to humiliate you. Where are we? 48. Yes, okay, fine. I want to humiliate. Uh, let's clear all of that. It's a bit of a shame. Good thing to do, but can I? Oh, all right, I can't. I can't anyway. Well, I can if I just do take a slightly less money, I think. Like, a, a lot less money, as a matter of fact. 146, I mean, I'm making money, so... This is fine. Humiliation, get this, I'll take this in another war. That's cool. Get that, fine. We have some more territory to handle. That was, you know, fairly easy. All things considered. Let's uh, make our way back here, because we need to... Rebel stomp a little bit here. And obviously, now there can be even more Ottoman Separatists. But what I was going to do that I didn't was to build a spy network here. You are, for some reason, in the war with Lithuania. Oh, right, you're going for... You, you used the uh, situation here with the war against Crimea. That's a okay. Uh, I would like to go for Karaman. Like, now. Uh, you can just rebel stomp here, for now. We'll deal with you if you spawn, should not be a problem. Uh, again with the stability, can I just get stability at some point? Well, we'll improve the situation then. We will take up you, get some better cannons. I, which one do I like? Defensive morale, as well as some defensive shock. Yes, I think that I like that. And uh, how we're looking here, we're trading a bit behind now on admin. So we will uh, we'll keep going, because we do need that. How how badly are we doing? We are, we're doing six, so it's not too bad. But yeah, our corruption is growing right now, so let's make sure that it doesn't. Which means that we're not getting any money, but we are gonna mothball all of our forts. And we should be good. Right, uh, you, how many more ships can I have? Zero more ships. I can presumably have a lot more here though. Well, five, not not that much. <laughs> uh, we're doing two, seven. Let's go to more infantry. Because I would like to go for Karaman like now and just clear all of this. And obviously I'm gonna do that by myself. Uh, we have our, we have our rebels. Cool. That's done then. Uh, you don't need to rebel stomp anymore. Cancel that. Yep, there we go. So, as soon as we get to uh, where I need to be with the spider book, should have done that earlier. Need to be a little bit more effective here. Ulm apparently wants to uh, have some open borders. And Ansbach, can you sort of move your troops out of here now? Would be cool. Uh, you're, you became a vassal. Well, okay. That's arguably bad. Man, the mammoth is gonna be seventy-three thousand. Holy crap! Holy crap on a cracker. What am I gonna do about the mammoths? <laughs> well, helping uh, Poland and Lithuania become. Stronger and better, I guess, is a good thing. Yeah, they have 60,000 between them, which means that together with mine, we are at over a hundred thousand. Uh, see so yeah, if well, we can't add them right now. Why does it say right? Because you have a, you have a really a, a lot of artillery for some reason, which is you know a good thing, something I should be emulating, but I'm not right now, but whatever. Uh, 
could get, I mean, you can see here, if I get Poland and uh, Mamluks in, we are actually, uh, yeah, we are actually a little bit above them in total. We might actually be able to defend ourselves slightly. I actually have rebels, Hungarian separatists. Why do I have rebels? And what truces do I have? I still have Croatia and Serbia and Hungary. So all of these I still have truces with. Fair enough. Uh, make our way down here. Turn you on, you on, and you on. You know what? We'll turn this on since I have rebels over there. Because apparently I do. We should be able to get this back right. By proxy of the... Uh, by proxy of the Ford. There we go. Belgrade has been returned to us. See, so yeah, are you... You are fighting? Yes. Uh, Crimea presumably won't join in this war, by the way. I would assume. Yep. So we're going to be fighting just <laughs> just Karaman, which is uh, what I need to do before before the Mamluks do. So we're going to have to go on February 1st. There we go. Get the claim. Hamid, stop building spy network. Wait a few days and declare war. Take Hamid. I don't need any allies here. Let's march for their capital. And you're back. Are you just going to go back and forth here? Is that what's going to happen? Well, fine. You do that. Now, I am going to claim as much land as I can here in one fell swoop. So we'll see uh, see what I can do. So we've done that. <laughs> well, sometimes, so sometimes I get to do things fast. By the way, do I have access? No, I don't. So let's just get that. No reason not to. Okay, we can uh, transfer tax into Constantinople. That's a good thing. Because Constantinople is obviously a place that uh, produces a lot of tax revenue for us. And my trader can die. We lose prestige. Or my diplomatic advisor leaves. Or I can lose a whole bunch of... Who, who, who do I like the least? Oh, I actually don't have an advisor here. So either you or you. Uh, you are the cheaper one. So Marcus, sadly you die. Die, die, die. Uh, what do we have to replace you? No ones. Well, that's, that's unfair. Um, you are neither of you cheaper, so we're gonna have to go with you. Okay, well, fine. We'll have to wait there for another diplomat, I guess. Are you anywhere? Nope, you're, you're not anywhere, so you don't really bother me. Again, don't play ineffectively. Go down a siege. There's no reason not to siege that. Um, Bavaria, sure, you can have access. Ooh, here we go. Get Burger some land. How much land am I currently wheeling? I don't want to go under 30, so sorry. That is not going to fly. And we're going to stability, so I'm happy about that. Could probably have spent a little bit of uh, admin power to get more uh, out of that, but whatever. And we are going to build some more of these. So one there, absolutely one here. Yes, for now. So there we go. All of our cores are also done pretty damn soon. Patriot Authority or admin power. We are not in a stress right now for Patriot. Authorities, let's get the admin power and the litter power. <laughs> Is it raking in that power? We are at a hundred percent. So much can I take? I want to take everything. Can't take that for obvious reasons. And it's going to be the same, right? Yes, same things as always. So get that. We don't get reparations. I kind of want to. Kind of want to get the reparations as well. So there we go. That territory is mine. Mine, mine, mine. Core everything. Get all of you sort of around here, I guess. We'll be rebel stomping here. I know that I'm a little bit overextended, but not anymore. We can get money or prestige. Don't, not really in a immediate hurry to get prestige, I think. So let's just get the money. Uh, have you gotten anyone? Yeah, spy network construction. Not super great, but what can you do, eh? 
Uh, when am I gonna be able to take this territory back? I mean, the Mamluks and Aragon are my biggest problems right now, and exactly how am I gonna deal with this? And I did. Where, where's that? Which uh, territory is that? That's over here. Right, fine. Get into here. Get into here. And. Rebel suppress. All the way over here. Probably don't need that one. Uh, we will do that, yes. And apparently this as well. Uh, but we aren't close to that, so fine. And our truce is over here, 68 and 69. So we can still wait for that a, a, a while. Now as for the Ottomans, I still have uh, Conquest CBs here. And what did the truce end up being? 79, so 12 more years. Beautiful. Okay, we have another affair. Is it the same uh, Basileia that had this affair? Okay, whatever. Loose prestige. That's fine. And let us also mothball our forts. We don't need to pay that much. Uh, that needs to be like it is. For a little while at least. Uh, yes. I'm still looking at this. I do want to reduce this. But we are reducing. We have reduced corruption at least a little bit now. So, you know, that's good. We have some territories that we could do. That's an entire territory over there. That's a good territory to do. And we don't really have anything else right now. How are we looking for... Uh, yeah, we're way away from governing capacity, so not a problem. We can keep... We can actually do all of this. There's really no reason to wait here. We can get all of this. All of this. And the final one. There we go. That's the rebels. They're getting squished. Yep, we're still looking fine. Yep, 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 yep. Could use a whole bunch of uh, admin power for that, but I do want to increase my tech, so we're going to have to wait. Uh, men mentees. Which one was that then? Mentees. Oh, right, this is where we're literally standing. Cool, cool. Serbia, you want some uh, military access, but we're gonna fight soon, so I don't know exactly why you would want that, but sure. Losing a bit of admin power there. We get a oh, skill 3, I could use a skill 2. Nope, we, we're gonna have to get just the uh, extra power there, which is fine as well. By the way, ooh, I have some, uh, I have some uh, decisions to make. Missionary strength. Missionary strength, yes. Uh, I don't want that one, but that means that ooh, we can actually start. Uh, <laughs> we can start converting a bit because we're a bit, a bit bad at the whole missionary thing. So uh, we're not going to do that right now, though. Also, I need to sort of think about: Do I want to remain Orthodox? Can I be anything else? I can convert, so uh, I don't know exactly how you convert. If even if you wanted to, how do you do that? I don't know. Yeah, the man looks. You are going to be an issue, and Ethiopia is actually a problem. Uh, but presumably, you are fighting Ethiopia for Adalans' uh, sake, or Adals, sorry. Um, okay, some lowered unrest there. So you are fighting Adal, Mamluks, Kanner, and Funj. You are fighting. Ethiopia. <laughs> so even if Ethiopia was large, they're not that terrible, actually. <laughs> so who who can go for uh, who can go for the Mamluks? Where where is uh, Trebizond? Oh, T Timurids. Sorry, Timurids. Timurids are here. Right. Will we see an explosion of some sort at some point? I don't know. Uh, you are going over there. Hopefully you will make it before they have siege. No, you will not. So we're going to get some separatism. That is a shame. Oh, well. Improve relations down. Not a big problem. See, at this point we are just handling 
Rebels, do you do you walk back after you've done that? And uh, answer is yes, you do. Cool, cool. Because we do have the mentees separatists here. Still a problem. And uh, okay, Venice threatening trade. Can we attack you soon? Aragon, Genoa, and Tuscany. This is, doesn't seem like a big deal, as a matter of fact, as long as I can get my allies with me. For right now, we cannot. Poland is in debt. Mamluks uh, apparently like Venice for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. They're also a bit more exhausted, a bit lacking in manpower, etc. etc. My. Is my. Why is that? Oh, extension. Sure. And f slightly low legitimacy, I guess. <laughs> Just a little bit. But I have a. I have a. No, I actually. I, I had a strong. Or, or is it you that was a strong one? Okay. So what do we, did we get? 314. Yes. Totally forgot about that. Okay, we can get more diplo tech, trade efficiency, etc. up. I'll take that. Even though it might have been slightly expensive, but I don't think it necessarily was. Get more territories up. Like that. We shall wait a little bit for that. There we go, getting the Karaman course in. And we have the Mentees. They have spawned. Now we have Saruhani up there. We have Byzantine. Right, that's over there. Why, 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 are you, why don't you like life? What's up? What's up with you? Why do you not like stuff? Separatism for some reason. Separatism from what? <laughs> well, it was Ottoman at some point. That is true. Uh, but those are noble rebels. So even if they spawn, that is not going to cause any wild issues. Intolerance is probably one of the things, yes. But we will sit with the army down here. What is going to be our next... Oh, yeah, the Lithuania took a big chunk here. By the way, what's, uh, what's our deal? We can trust up a bit. We are probably at full thrust. Thrust? <laughs> full thrust! Full trust over here. Yes, we are not at full trust over here, so we can do a little bit more of that. That is the next of those. We'll do that. We will territory this as well. Now the problem is, I am blocked here. Uh, how do I do with that? I mean, Theodora would be a thing. Theodora would be a thing. If I, oh right, they have a lot of troops. Combined. Russia. Oh, Russia. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Russia, you say. Okay, well, because what I was thinking is if we can get that, then we have an access to QQ. If we have access to QQ, well, we can go for stuff over here, but we cannot do anything uh, to attack you. We have no possible neighboring provinces. So, what do I do about that? What do I do about that? We can't do anything over here. Because whatever thing it is, we could go some sort of the way around. Huh. This is all not really shaping up good. I'm so happy doing what I did over here, but now things are just not working out for me, are they? You, however, are allied to Venice. Well, isn't that interesting? Now, isn't this interesting? Venice, you say? We can take... Oh, I mean, okay, fine, we don't need that much from Venice, but we need some things from Venice. And with this, that wouldn't be a terribly bad thing. You are fighting with Aragon against Tunis. And that is... <laughs> How are you this unlucky? Holy crap. Okay. Well, Aragon, you're fighting... Oh. Oh, you are fighting Portugal. Well, 
That is an interesting war. That is an interesting war. But you are fighting uh, a lot. Uh, you have a royal marriage and an ally alliance with Castile, but they're apparently not in this war. You, because you're fighting Tunis. Presumably to get to Portugal, to be honest. And Aragon has some stuff over here. Uh, if I'm lucky, someone comes and takes this. <laughs> but yeah, okay. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna say fine, whatever. Uh, yes, I'm okay with that. Uh, get the get the force back up. Fort up, because if I attack you, and by the way, I just realized that I don't have a claim anymore. I had claims. Uh, to, sure, you can walk in my territory. There we go. That's the tech up I wanted. We should now not have a problem with innovative dimness that I will never be able to pronounce. We still have. Are you that far away? I had 14 admin. <laughs> I was 12. You're way ahead. Um, yeah. If I go for you. Medicine Gelre. Gelre. I don't know how to pronounce that actually. But uh, with you. Should not be that big of a deal. As a matter of fact. Uh, what are we doing money wise right now? Why are. Well, we just got the force back up. Get some back from that, but I would like to get one more each of you, which is gonna cost, but it should be fine. Should be fine, I say. <laughs> we shall see. This doesn't seem like a war I should lose, right? And if I can get this little territory down here, that would be cool. Because that is almost my goal. Get this little territory down here. As well as here, by the way. Yes, as well as here. Uh, Kataro is in my uh, area here. Uh, how much are you going to cost? 53. You know what? I'm just going to do that. Get rid of you for now. The Byzantines I don't really care about. Again, they're not going to invoke any... Uh, any separatism, which is the biggest issue there. Right, uh, right, I have a fort down here. Do I want this fort? No, no, I don't want this fort. I should have removed this earlier. I know it's a coastal fort, but it's in... Uh, uh, it's a coastal fort in hills. You know what? Screw it. L let's, let's keep that. Let's keep a few forts over here. I have four forts kind of nicely placed here, so why not? This is the only fort that I kind of would like to get rid of, but it is in woods, so again, that is why I have kept that one. Right, so we have our troops here. We are losing money, but only one, so that uh, sort of feels okay. So if we can just get a claim down here, so we can attack them without having the humiliation uh, CB. The humiliation CB is the bad one. <laughs> uh, ooh... Mamluks aren't really liking me for various reasons. Why do you not like me? Aggressive expansion, yes. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, let's get the claim. Let's do uh, Hemis. Temis? Sure. I'm okay with Temis being my goal. There we go. Attack you. Get everyone in on this. Conquest, yes. That, uh, that seems pretty fine. Let's go for that. Was that actually a... That was actually a fort. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't even think that that was a fort, but okay, whatever. We'll, we'll, we'll take it. I didn't see if it was uh, actually maintained. Was it? It was. Fair enough. That's fine. So, Venice is actually coming down here, so hopefully I will get some help. <laughs> Hopefully I'll get some help from various people. They have... Man. That's that's heavily fortified. <laughs> that is heavily fortified. Uh, they're coming down. CG down some stuff, which is A-OK. -okay. Uh, they've come down here, actually. Which is... Again, which is fine. We're just gonna siege down the entirety of the hunger here, just to be done with them. And as soon as we are, we are moving on. But we're a little bit unlucky here. Ooh, what's happening? Enemy invasion imminent. 
Well, sure, whatever. Uh, yep, some fights starting here. What are the Mamluks gonna do? Like, where are you going to go? Because I would like for the Mamluk ships to arrive. Just saying. Uh, let's start marching down. So I would like to uh, get rid of people down here. If I can. Right. A lot of production, but also a lot of unrest. Or loyal burgers with unrest and tax modifier. But one uh, base production, that's basically... I mean, on average, I'd say that's oh, about 200 or more Diplo power. Which is kind of useful. Yes, let's do it. Let's, uh, let, let's uh, spend the potential issues that we're gonna have from that. Because uh, we might. We might actually have some issues. Uh, there we go. That's a fight. Let's get in there. Let's get in and fight the Venetians. Where are you going, Orid? Let's go up and fight you. There we go. Now you can get over there and siege that down. Why did I start at such low morale? What the hell was that about? Oh, never mind. Let's fight you. There we go. Let's fight you. Little thing here. Did I... What the hell happened to my fleet? Did my fleet just get shanked? It did. Well, beautiful. <laughs> okay. Sure, whatever. If you say so. Yeah, I know that Venice has a large fleet. I know. Oh, yeah, they have a pretty damn powerful fleet. Yes. I, I realize that now. Uh, that's fine. That is fine. I hope. Why, why is my morale so low? Okay, let's just chill out a bit. I need to recover some morale, I think. Uh, where can we stand? Here we go. Let's just go down here and chill. I need to recover morale here. Um, question is, can I piece you out and take this? Who's gonna hate me for that? Not too bad. Uh... But I need ten. Yeah, I need a thousand. Rather, ten war score. Yeah, that, that's fine. We're gonna we're gonna get that uh, because we're sieging back this, and you are sieging Corfu. Ooh, can I get Corfu? I would be fairly happy as well. So what's up with my morale here? There we go. Get the morale back, please. Also, we can get the uh, we can get reformation stuff. What can I get here? Mercenaries, I don't care about. But yeah, why not? Religious wars. That's fine. Okay. Morale has been recovered. But I'm never going to get out there. So let's go up and uh, siege down over here. Because <laughs> that's what we can do. Oh, what? No. <laughs> no. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to... Yeah, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that's my, uh, my fleet again. It's going to be more money, I guess, but not that much. <laughs> Jesus. I knew that that was a bad idea, going against Venice and trying to win naval battles, but, uh, you know, whatever. So again, I'm not actually uh, planning to take anything from Hungary. I'm just, uh, I'm just fighting you to get to Venice. Because I would like this territory. So there's basically two territories that I, that I do want, which is these two. Of course, we got the rebels, but uh, luckily, the Mamluks were just passing by. <laughs> Beautiful. And you're trying to block, but you can't because I have all the territory here. So, screw you. And we are going to be able to siege down most of Venice. Most of Venice is going to be ours. Ob obviously, never in Venetia because it is basically impossible to get Venetia. <laughs> Because they have the naval control and you can't really get anyone over there. That is, a, that is a story for a long period of time, I think. We do have Yelre, yes. Where where are you? And exactly, you're way over there. Can go for you as well. I guess at some point. I'm going to try to finish this episode off with the slow war here. 
if we could get a little bit lucky here. Someone is actually... Someone was actually able to go over there. Who, who's that? Lip. For some reason you were able to go over there. Don't know exactly how, but you were. You were... Or were you? Or were you just there? So what, what rebels came? Not now the... Oh, the noble rebels. We don't care about those. Uh, loose ducats. I don't think that that's a good idea right now, but we can get a lot of... Uh, yeah, I don't care about that. I'm not going to take this. I'm not taking that. Uh, go over here and fight. There we go. Fight, fight, fight. Uh, go over here. Siege, 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 siege. All my friends are here as well. Uh, this seems to go rather fast. What am I down to? 25. Would be... Would like to be even faster. Koslar! The nation I never heard of before, or the free city that I never heard of before. Okay, we are swiftly taking care of you. Um, Geller, you are sieged down, so just remove you, the white piece. Now, 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 Venice, I think that you will find that we will be having some territory off of you. Yes, you would like to give me that. Would you like to give me Corfu as well? Yes, you would. I guess that uh, Mamluks might have a problem with this, but I don't care. Let's get uh, as much as I can here. Bit of money, like that. Do I... what do I want here? Ooh, I can get you to revoke this core. That I want, yes. I think this is a fair one. Yeah, get the territory I want over here, as well as these two islands. Thank you! Bye-bye. Get all of our troops back home, and we will deal with you. Where are you going? Silistria is where you are going. Where is... where is that again? That is over there. Long way away. Uh, fair enough, we will walk over here. Go, go, go. Get our person back here. What can I do with you? I can humiliate you, yes. You are my rival for some reason. I'm not going to take anything from you, I'm just going to rob you of your money. As well as having you revoke some cores, like that. Return cores to Serbia, I don't care about that. Uh, release nations, no we don't need that, uh, we don't need that either. I'm okay with this. We don't need to take anything, there we go. Give me money, give me uh, nice power projection, etc, etc, and that's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, keep doing states. We should be fine with this, right? This doesn't... This doesn't increase that much. <laughs> is, there, is there a reason why it isn't increasing that much? Uh, by the way, how much is this? 765. Why? Printing press. Right, we're not going to do anything until we get the printing press. Uh, get the mothball of the forts down. You should be moving soon. Uh, right, we need to do this. Overextension, core up with those. This is looking better. And we can actually do this subject. Let's uh, placate local rulers. No, why did we do that? That was stupid. That's not what I wanted. I didn't want the liberty to decide. I want you to like me. Uh... We can send you a gift. Yes. That is fine. Send you a gift. And once we have sent the gift, and it has become the 21st of May, we start the annexation. And that is where we're going to leave this episode off. So, an episode full of uh, nice little things. Uh, expanded well into Anatolia on this, in this episode. And I think we should be able to get the rest of uh, this territory from the Mamluks in the next war. I hope they would have to split it up into two wars, that would be annoying. But, Mamluks, yes. At some point I'm going to have to go for you, and it's gonna hurt, like a lot. But since you took Kandar as your vassal, yeah. That is, uh, that is annoying that you did there, that you did that. That is very, very annoying, because you blocked me off of this territory over here, which we need. 
And you are no longer in that war. You took a whole bunch of stuff from Tunis. So that's more bad stuff happening over there. So my uh, my uh, <laughs> my hopes and dreams for achieving this uh, achievement is uh, it's not going super well, is it? Uh, but I mean, it's going well, but it's also going not well because of other other things. But uh, if I break my uh, alliance with the Mamluks, I need someone else. I need another powerful ally. Now, who is that? Who is that other powerful ally? Who are you rivaling? You're rivaling Portugal and France. How far away are you from liking me? Yeah, you don't like me because I'm uh, allied to the Mamluks, but you know what? We, we shall uh, remove you and then let's actually do that. Start talking to France. If I can get France on my side, which is obviously not going to work really now that I think about it, because you know they're really far away, so they're not really going to want to fight her. But let's uh, let's talk to them anyway. I think that that might be a thing worth doing. So in the next episode, potentially it's time for the Ottomans again. It's uh, actually only five years left, so yes, we also have Serbia that we can attack. Uh, we have. We have stuff that we can do over here. Uh, we have a lot of conquest stuff. So, again, Venice. <laughs> uh, it's going to be fine. We can fight Venice out one more time. Because uh, if I'm going to take... Uh, that, that is actually not territory I need. The Venice territory here. I just want this. So that's what we're going to go for, presumably, in the next episode as well. Because we're not just expanding down here. We're expanding over here as well. So, yeah. That is what we are going to do in the next episode. For now, though, this has been Ghostbed Gaming with me, Christopher. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.